Good morning guys. So welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome back. If you are a recurring viewer today, well really this week, I'm going to be taking you through what I'm up to and explaining some life updates. As you've just seen, I've done a workout and I am so sweaty after that. I literally have drips like on my chin and just like I wiped most of it off like let's face it but very sweaty very happy that I did that workout I guess a quick little explanation for this is I've had some like a neck and trap pain um, and so I went and saw my physio yesterday and he taped it up and had a look at it and I think it was really important that I went and saw him because if I just left that it would have gotten worse he said and so now I can rehab it and get it better anyway with that done let's have some breakfast this is what I'm having um, I also had some salad but I ate it while I was cooking all of this so there was salad just just imagine and now let's go catch a flight Hello, I have not chatted to the camera very much in this video so far. Um, that is because things got busy, let's just say. I don't even know where to start. I guess a little update. If you have been following along with these vlogs, you will remember at the end of last year, I talked about a big tour with the show that I normally perform with dummies to answer the like the big elephant which is Ellen why are you not on tour right now Ellen why are you only just now on tour so we had some problems with our tour we lost some funding and some venues fell through you know like just 
life happened. The pandemic is still happening and it is still affecting a lot of our shows. Um, so we lost kind of like the first three months of work when we were supposed to be in WA and that was mostly just Hello. He's calling me. Hi. Okay, and resuming after I got a call from my boyfriend, which was super lovely. What was I saying? Uh, yeah, we lost all of that work in WA, mostly because we couldn't get in to WA because that was at the very start of the year when there was like difficulties with the borders. But um, yeah, there was like a lot of like, oh, we can't get in, we'll try for this. That didn't work, let's try and try like this other way of getting in. And there was just like a lot of sort of like, oh, oh no. Go, we got, oh, we're not going. Um, yeah, just a lot of that. Um, but we are now sort of like at the point where we would have finished the three months of the WA section of the tour. And we're now on to our Victoria tour, which is why we're here now. So it wasn't just the WA tour that fell through. There was a lot of other stuff that fell through because of funding, venues just like uh, pulling out on us and just like a myriad of other reasons why we've lost a fair bit of like other work. Um, basically we have, it was nine weeks and it's gone down again. I think it's like just eight weeks or just under eight weeks of work now um which if you watched that vlog i will leave the link up here to that vlog yeah just just a little bit crushed anyway but the great news is we are finally going on tour let's bring the mood back up here we're leaving tomorrow i was supposed to film like before we did the rehearsals um but i will put the footage before this so what you just saw was some footage from us in the rehearsal space sort of just like finding our feet again because we like the three of us haven't worked worked together for nine months good we loved that there was lots of giggles lots of fun it was really nice to train with the girls again as you saw but I have to pack first and somehow everything exploded and I have a very organized person so let's pack pack with me I'm grab a coffee grab a tea I'm gonna chuck on a TV show I'm gonna watch the season finale of the latest season of Survivor because I've been watching that a lot of fun. I'm gonna grab myself a glass of wine if that is your choice of a beverage. But let's go.
you can hear these. I'm just setting up camp for the night. <laughs> Last night we checked in to our little motel. This is it. Got a cute little kitchenette where I've literally spread out everywhere. Um, very comfortable. Had a good sleep. Also, this motel place is so cute. You can see the mountains, and you can see the mountains on the other side too. It's just so gosh darn cute. So, made myself some breakfast because I brought a little bit of breakfast food with me and we got some yesterday just from like from a food works in the by. But now it is makeup time. Ready? I'm not quite done, but I will finish it off at the venue. Good morning. Just thought I'd have a little chat while I make my breakfast. Um, yes. I brought a blender with me on tour. You do what you do. This blender literally came from like Melbourne. Like I didn't fly with it from Brisbane. Um, yeah, but very good. I have smoothies a lot, so just makes sense, you know? I just feel like you can't go past a smoothie, like honestly. Can't really get the good stuff. Yeah. The good stuff in this smoothie being my psyllium. Sorry. Iodine. Mycelium. And then of course cordyceps and also a lion's mane. I have a little code for these if you want a little discount um, to try them out. They I really enjoy them, I really like them. I find that they like really help with like my energy levels and my concentration, especially on show days. Bada bing, bada boom. So I guess I wanted to recap. Yesterday we had our first show back after nine months. It was so good. We had 200 over 200 school kids it was a lot of fun the show is like it's there it's in our bodies we you know didn't really like forget anything like major and we just kind of had a lot of fun honestly it was great but this vlog is pretty long i wanted to give you guys an idea of what an unusual sort of like two weeks a week and a half i don't know looks like in my life um stay tuned 
subscribe because there's going to be a lot more of vlogs like this. I've got a fair bit of touring over the next couple months and so I want to do a lot more vlogs, take you guys along with me because one, I really like documenting this stuff for myself and then people also honestly, like these are my most popular videos. So why not make more of them for you guys? Anyway, if you did enjoy the video, please give it a like because it really supports my channel. And I have recently made a buy me a coffee page because I don't earn anything from all of this work that I do. So if you do want to support a struggling circus artist, there is a buy my coffee link down in my description below. Buy me a coffee because I would really appreciate it. And with that, I will see you guys next time. Bye. So it really was. I can't tell. That's going to annoy me so much. Like it looks. Just on an angle.